The lights on, they're off and racing. Nevertheless, a little bit slow out. She's all ours, went straight to the lead. Kimberly Cold goes up to Eye Bullet. Nevertheless, now getting right up on the inside after that tardy beginning. And Penthouse Poppy just drops in for a sit behind them. It's She's All Ours just in the middle of the pack here. Getting up on the inside is Nevertheless. They were followed then three deep around them by Kimberly Cold and Penthouse Poppy is last of all. Inside the 600 held together Nevertheless and all She's All Ours on its outside together. They were followed by Penthouse Poppy now starting the knuckle of the task and Kimberly Cole dropped out of the rear. Coming to the home corner, Nevertus nursed around the corner here, led by about a half a length of She's All Ours. Nevertus skipped away halfway down the straight here, got a couple in front. She's All Ours under the whip trying to run on and then Penthouse Poppy starting to make ground now. It's Nevertus in front. She's All Ours wants to run around a bit but it's Nevertus clear at the moment. She's All Ours trying hard but it's Nevertus. Nevertus Penthouse Poppy making late ground. Down the outside, She's All Ours! Oh, I don't know. Nevertheless might have just got in, but she's all ours absolutely flew the last minute and might have got up. A little wide apart, and I'm not sure now. I was going to call Nevertheless the winner, but she's all ours has made a real dive on the outside. Made it very close. Uh, third, Penthouse Poppy, and Kimberly Cole, the last one in. Well, that race changed complex in the last 10 metres because... She's all out very, very wide. I just don't know. It's made a dive. I was hailing Nevertus the winner. Two's got it. Number two, Nevertus has held on. Number two, Nevertus. Written by Shane Pawsey. I tell you what, he just got there. She's all ours has made a real lunge, Sonia Wiseman, on the outside, but Nevertus. Look, the winner at the 100 metre mark, I, was, I think he might have been just uh, giving it a nice little run to the line. A short head. A short head, the margin. The numbers are 2134. 2134. 2134. A short head just got there by a length between second and third and hand timed. It'll be a hand time. We'll have that shortly. 56.92. Thanks, Ray. And margins a short head by a length. Two, one, three. Never to Shane Pawsey has just got there from She's All Hours, written by Sonia Wiseman. And third goes to number three, Penthouse Poppy, written by Braden Swaffer. So the numbers in the first two, one, three, four. Two, one, three, four. Short head, heart attack stuff. A length and 56.92 uh, is hand time. Two, one, three, four, the numbers uh, after the first. Two, one, three, four. Nevertus for Robin Jane Kosh by Canardis from Stormy Weather. Uh, Shane Pawsey and Fred Wheeland. A short head. Second, She's All Ours for uh, H. Rowe, Trevor Rowe, DJ Smith, J.D. Smith, S. King, G. King, R. Roberts, Mrs. J.P. Roberts, S. Shandyman and Lal Shandyman. Sonia Wiseman for Trevor Rowe and third Penthouse Poppy, Brayden Swaffer also for the Rose, have finished third in the event. So it's two, one, three, a short head, a length between second and third.
Okay, uh, after race number one here, we've got uh, Jane Kosh, uh, one of the uh, owners of uh, Nevitus. Uh, the sponsor is uh, TJ Cleaning Services, and it's a cutest race, and a uh, little bit of heart failure there, uh, Jane, near the line. Yes, she, um, I thought she had it there, but I think she tired on the run. Fred did say the other day that she was probably one short of a run, so once she gets going, she's certainly be going to be something to contend with. Um, Rob and I bought her at the Magic Millions Ready to Runs just recently, and she actually had a better breeze-up time than the horses we sold, and um, we were really interested in her. We haven't syndicated her, but she's now for sale. She's just registered and ready to go. I couldn't get a bad little buy there. It was a nice little run and very quick indeed. OK, on behalf of the Cairns Jockey Club and TJS uh, Cleaning Services, I'd like to give you that. Also, the uh, Simply Hamper Rabber. Thanks very much, and thank you for TJ Cleaning Services for sponsoring the race, and I hope everybody has an enjoyable Melbourne Cup day. Shane Pawsey for the ride, of course, Shane. That was excellent. And also Fred and Lynn for the training. Thank you very much, Jane. Congratulations. Uh, winning the first on the program, Nevitus, number two, the winner. It's up for sale if you want to buy uh, Nevitus. Uh, might be a handy little horse for uh, especially around here in Townsville, especially with cutest races coming up. Be a nice little one to get into. Uh, thank you very much to TJS Cleaning Services and uh, Rob and Jane Costa and uh, Fred Wheel and Shane Pawsey. Congratulations on winning the first. Well, it's uh, welcome back to uh, the... Uh, the winning ranks uh, and back to the riding ranks for Shane Pawsey. He's been out of action for a while. Uh, came back the other week with a, with a couple of wins and uh, has once again recorded another win. Good to see you back in the saddle and riding winners, Shane. Where were you before? Um, Blue, we had about, oh, about four months off. I had a fractured shoulder, come back into the fray and rode a couple of meetings and then one, of, one on element of chance at his first start in Townsville, mate, and shortened a couple of them up so they decided that I need the holiday so I was suspended for about three weeks so today's the first day back. Well well done, nice one to come back to and get a nice win and uh, Nevertus is the correct pronunciation Jane tells me, Nevertus, uh, nice little win, uh, certainly moved along or what missed the start by a couple then kicked up on their inside and, uh, and fought on well at the line. I wasn't too sure whether you'd got there in the end though. No, I was a little bit the same in that um, Bluey, she was a touch slow to shift, just been a little bit green and she hopped into gear and sucked up really good. The favourite on the outside gives Sonia a bit of an awkward ride coming to the turn. And it, the further it got into the turn, the more it wanted to lug. And sort of I sucked up not too bad and skipped around the turn and got going. And she ran off. And that was probably a telling factor in the end, you know. Yeah. Nice little win uh, by Never Nevere to say. So congratulations. And on behalf of uh, Tony Basher and Barnacle Bills, who gives the $100 dining voucher to the winning rider of every race here at Cannon Park in Cairns, I'll give you that. And uh, congratulations. Thank you very much, um, Bluey. And it's always good of Tony, you know, to supply these sort of things. He does it out of the goodwill of his heart and he supports racing up here in far north, north Queensland in Cairns. And, mate, I take my hat off to the bloke. He does a marvellous job. Too right. His number one uh, reason for doing that is to support the jockeys. You guys uh, don't get a lot of credit uh, uh, in other ways and so he just likes to do that for the jocks. Look, he certainly goes out of his way to help us out and, and you know, we fully appreciate his generosity and that, but it's certainly great. Terrific. Thanks, uh, Shane, and good luck for the rest of the day. Bay <laughs> Rossa joins the line. All in spirit goes up. And Diva Dior 